What is going on guys? We are back with a different type of video. As some of you guys may know if you follow me, we have been vlogging, um, but this video is gonna be more information as you guys saw from the title. I just wanna show you guys something uh, that I've been getting asked a lot. And I just wanna be honest with you guys, I am a used car dealer for those that don't know. Um, in the Arizona area. I am 24 years old. I'm actually gonna take you guys outside to show you our little used car lot. It's nothing special, um, but it's our first one. Very, very, very proud of it. I'm gonna show you guys a couple really, really cool things in this video. Um, stay with me. First, I'm gonna show you guys our car lot, show you guys what type of inventory we have and where we're located and show you the progress that we have made um, so far. So come outside, I'm gonna show you guys this and then I'll break down what's about to happen. All right, so we are in Mesa, Arizona, and this is our car dealership. Caleb and I own it. Um, Caleb's last name is Karsten, mine is Moore, and it's called Karsten and Moore. Wow, there's a big gap. So we sold a lot of cars um, Saturday. I think we sold three, I don't know why. They, oh, and we took one home, so I guess there's four missing right there off that line. Um, there's the infamous Maserati, uh, but this is our used car lot. Again, we're 24 years old. There is nothing crazy about it, uh, but it is in a very good location. Our building is not special. I mean, it's literally as simple as it gets, but again, it's not always about that. Um, and I'll explain that further in the video and you guys will start to see more um, and understand what I mean in just a minute. So this is our used car lot. It is on Power Road in Mesa, Arizona. It is bright as can be, hot as can be in Arizona. Uh, but that is it behind me. Christian Brothers just got built. Um, but yeah, we're 24 years old. Caleb and I own it. As you guys can see, it's backwards a little bit. Maybe it won't be for the video, I don't know. But it's Karsten and Moore. My last name's Moore, his last name's Karsten. Um, Auto.com. You guys feel free to check that out. I think the link's in the description below. You'll see our inventory, how we have everything set up. We finance, we do cash deals, and we do buy your payers. So we will be the bank um, in certain situations. We will be the bank in certain situations, depending on the deal. Um, and you know, it just varies, but this is our dealership. I am super proud of it. Um, let me take you guys inside because I've been getting a lot of questions about a few things. And I'll talk to you about that in just a second. There's our Honda Groms. Caleb and I got inside the office. Pretty cool, that's Caleb's desk. This is my desk slash Sam's desk. We just got a um, saleswoman in here. We have the lobby. This is my new room uh, right here. It's just a little back room. I can focus, buy cars, bid on them, and go from there. So one second. As you guys saw from the title, uh, this video is about a few, two different things. So one, how many cars does Karsten & Moore or our dealership buy? I'll give you a little background. Our car dealership size can hold about 40 cars. We usually have 25 listed online at all times, about 35 purchased, but on average, about 10 of them always need a little bit of stuff. So whether like the check engine lights on because of catalytic converters and O2 sensors out, or the AC isn't working and we have to change the compressor, vacuum it down and recharge it, um, we have about 25 cars online at all time, give or take. Um, 10 of them of which usually are in the back, the ones against that back wall that you saw earlier, those are the ones that aren't ready yet. Those are part of the 10 or they're at another shop where we outsource our mechanic. Uh, we do have an in-house mechanic, but since it's our first car lot, it is so small, our, our room that we work on the cars in, we can't really put an AC machine in there. It's already tight enough as it is. Um, but again, we have 25 cars at all time listed online. So that gives you kind of a reference or an idea of, um, you know, based on how many cars I'm about to tell you that we turn every week. So basically our business strategy is mostly cash deal. We like that because it's so easy. You know, customer comes in, boom, you have a great deal. Um, I give you cash, sign papers, leave. They're happy, we're happy. We don't have to call a finance company, but we recently have been get, getting into the finance department. Um, we're using the lender called Red Mountain Funding. Super cool guy, went and golfed with him. The owner, really, really nice guy. Um, but yeah, let me show you guys how many we buy a week on average in my computer, and then we'll go from there. It might not be the most clear, but come inside my computer screen right now and check it out. 
Actually, I'm just gonna hold it like this and film it this away. Um, but I'm gonna go inside our dealer software or hosting software where our inventory is stored and how it's pushed um, to all of our social media platforms. So CarGurus, Facebook Marketplace, Offera, LetGo, Craigslist, all that stuff. But this is where it's hosted. And um, this actually will break down how many uh, we sell in a month. And then that basically is going to be how I transition into how many we buy a month. So give me one second, let me log in real quick. Okay, so there is a lot of information that I can't show you guys, but I will pull up our report. So we go to sales reporting, sales totals, and then we're going to do the current month. For, so from 701.20 to 731. Okay, actually I'm gonna have to print this off. Give me just a second. Aha, here we go. All right, let me print these and fold them so you guys can't see personal information. Okay, here we go. All folded, hidden, and um, it's not gonna reveal the customer's, uh, the customer's information, but it shows. So this is 70120 to 731. It is actually the 25th today or 26th. So we still have a few more days to get a couple more sales in before the month is over. But I'm gonna show you guys, since I'm filming, um, the 26th, I'm just gonna show you guys what we've done so far. So, uh, as we were talking, I just wanted to show you guys how many we have sold. You can see the dates right here, the vehicles as well. So we'll start from the top. 02 Toyota Camry, um, that was 701. So we only sold one on the first. Kia Sorento, 2011 model, 07 Hyundai Santa Fe. We sold two that day on the second. 07 Hyundai Santa Fe, 07 Jeep Wrangler or Commander, uh, we sold two that day as well. And then for three days, we had zero sales because the car market is so crazy. That kind of just goes to show you, it's not always consistent in this market, especially with the pandemic going on. But if you follow all the way down, you guys will see that is a total of, I think about 10, let's see. One, two, three, 11, 12, 13. So 13 on this page. So we sold 13, 13 cars by the 10th um, from the first. So if you move on, another sale from the 10th. So we sold 14 by the 10th. Um, we have a Yukon sale. We had no sales for three days. Um, and on the fourth day, we sold the Yukon. Uh, only one that day. Then we had one again, another one on the 15th. Uh, so two on the 15th, 16th, 18th. As you guys can see, you can pause the video if you guys want to. But the total amount of cars sold from the first to the 26th so not in 30 days is 30 on the dot so we have sold 30 vehicles at our used car dealership within 26 days during coronavirus which i don't think is too bad there's lines on my face because the sun is going down now but i want to get this video out for you guys so as you guys saw we sold 30 cars um, from July 1st to July 26th as of right now. Today's the 26th, I just looked. Um, I thought it could have been the 25th, but 26th. So that's over one car a day. Um, again, as you saw, we're on a gravel lot. Um, we are in a normal building, nothing fancy at all. So saying that, saying that we've sold 30 in 26 days and we've never had more this month than 25 cars for sale, our turnover rate is well above 100%. Um, which is really cool for us, but it makes us turn in volume. So we're giving people great deals rather than trying to get the most for our customers selling, you know, 15 a month, trying to make $2,000 a car. Uh, that's just not our strategy. We don't like that. I think it's more, um, I mean, maybe it works for some people, but uh, I think this is the best route to go because you please a lot more people and you get your name out a lot faster. Uh, but again, since we have sold 30 cars in 26 days, that means we need to at least to maintain buy 30 cars within the last 26 days to stay at an even pace. If not, we will be going backwards and we will do worse the next month. So it's very, very hard to keep up because as you saw, it is so random. Um, we buy, I don't wanna show you guys the website because it's a dealers only, but I'll show you guys the logo. Here it is right there. Hold on one second. Let me see if I can adjust this lighting. All right, there we go. So uh, the lighting is a little better. There's still a line. We buy from ACB Auctions, as you can see right there. It is a dealer only um, online auto auction. They give us a 10 day guarantee. It sounds super risky. Um, but again, we sold 30 cars in the last 26 days. We are apparently the second, um, I guess, most busy buyer 
uh, for them is what they told us, the ACV rep. Uh, out of 400 dealerships, we have bought the second most amount um, in the last 30 days. So I'm, I'm pretty sure we have bought around 38 cars in the last 30 days. So we're actually growing um, on top of this. So we're selling 30, buying 38. So next month will be set up even better than the last month. And as time goes on, hopefully this virus gets you know less and less dramatic. More people start coming out of their houses, buying cars. So you know if this is a bad month, um, I think we're doing pretty good for being only six months in. I've been doing this since I was 15 years old. Um, this is our first dealership, first location, but again, 30 cars in the last 26 days, and we have bought 38 cars from ACV Auction. So we're gonna be set up a little bit better than last month, and as time goes on, our name's gonna get out there. That's gonna boost us. Referrals will come in. So hopefully our sales increase. Hopefully we can do like 40 cars next month with only having 25 cars listed online at a time. I think that's a pretty good turnover rate. It's like a hundred and something percent. Don't know the math there. I'm not that good at math. Um, unless there's a dollar sign in front of it, I'll figure it out. But uh, I think that's a pretty good rate. If we had a hundred cars, we would be selling about 120. If we kept this pace up, of course, we'd have to hire more people. There'd be more overhead, but I think it would still make up for it tenfold. So it's just a, a scaling game at this point. Um, we're trying to scale in a, in a storm of coronavirus, but uh, that is information that a lot of dealers won't tell you. I'm 24 years old, started a car dealership in Arizona. If there's anybody that's gonna start a dealership, it's gonna be me. So Caleb and I chose to do this. We're on Power Road. If you guys wanna click the website down below. I mean, that just goes to show you, only 25 listed and we've sold 30. Our deals aren't bad, I promise you guys. Click the link down below, check it out. If you guys wanna follow me, Caleb, or Ricky on Instagram, click the other links down below. We also have the free Facebook group where we find the best deals in our area. Although I'm using ACV a little more now, I'm probably gonna start getting back into OfferUp because ACV has been a little slow the last couple weeks. Um, just so I can maybe even get, you know, one extra car a week from a private party and then, you know, fix it up and then sell it from here. But that's really just it, guys. We have sold 30 cars in 26 days. Hopefully we can hit 35 before the 30 day mark. Wish me luck. Thank you guys so much for watching. That is it for this video. Click the subscribe button, follow, comment down below. If you think 30 cars for the amount of inventory we're holding and how new we are is good. If you guys have an interesting story about anything car related, comment down below. I love hearing car related stories because they can either go really good or really bad, really fast. So I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. 30 cars, 26 days. Hopefully next month, you guys will see an update video and it'll be 40 cars in 30 days. We will see. See you guys in the next video.